Hello, I'm in the USA, I'm in the state of Washington, and I'm taking a look at the west coast city of Seattle. Seattle, throughout its history, has proved itself to be one of America's most resilient cities, constantly weathering disasters, economic and natural, from its perch on the Pacific coast. Starbucks started here in Seattle. It was founded in 1971. I'm not good on heights, but I'm on the 35th floor of the Smith Tower. This was once the tallest building west of New York. but I think I might like to get down now. If you plan to go to Seattle, it's well worth visiting Chihuly Garden and Glass, which offers a comprehensive collection of Dale Chihuly's significant series of work.
Did they throw you some money? Now Seattle has an impressive transport system and the monorail has been in place since 1962 when the mile long track was built to connect the downtown area with the World Fair. It still operates on a daily basis. Now under Seattle is a bus and light rail network called the Transit Tunnel where both types of vehicles use the same tunnels. The light rail connects the downtown area with SeaTac International Airport. Now this is Everett about 40 minutes from Seattle and this is what is claimed to be the world's largest building. something that you simply have to do if you visit Seattle and that's come along and do a tour of the Boeing factory. Tours of the Boeing factory are easy to book, they depart from the Future of Flying Museum but be warned no cameras or phones are allowed. You can however see and photograph new completed aircraft from the museum and if you're lucky you might see something taking off from the runway. 747s, 777s and 787s are built here. The 737s are built at Renton on the other side of Seattle. A good side trip from Seattle is to take the ferry from Pier 52 to Bainbridge Island. Uh, the ferry is cheap and operates at regular intervals and you get good views of Seattle and the small town of Winslow on the island has several restaurants and good walks to enjoy.
and that's Seattle. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think of the video.